Alright, recording, recording, recording. I just finished the Tome of Lilithia. And uh, I. And. Fine. And now I'm doing the. Uh, well, I'm gonna be doing the festival. Um, first checking to make sure I got some things here. <coughs> Because it's been like five months, remember? I didn't? Son of a bitch. Not. Hey, why don't you go help prepare for the festival? I'm the only one who should be playing hooky. Well, fuck you, bitch. Fucking asshole. So that means I gotta hurry up and run around and make sure I can forget any of the other treasures. Why don't you dream chasers take a break for a change? Go see the festival. What do you think I'm gonna do, asshole? I fucking love the festival. Wow, okay. Glad I didn't forget too much, too much about this, damn. Uh, we'll go ahead and give it some jack as well. Oh yeah, we have to get Cecilia a magic spell. Cecilia needs a magic spells. Hillberry. And magic carrot. You gotta love magic carrots. That's a nice fountain. Alright, uh, I think that's all the treasure. Oh, no, there's one more treasure. One more treasure. Hiding over here behind the church. Believe this nonsense? The church trying to smuggle antidotes. Ow. You fucking twat. You got my face. Alright. So, <clears throat> we combined some magic. Uh white magic I don't know if I want to go with shield to increase my defense or if I want to go with revive it's a tough one because I don't have many reviving items currently I have uh one revive fruit holy fuck I mean I'm probably going to get some more as prizes from the fucking uh finger my bobber the festival <clears throat> but Whatever. <coughs> and I just woke up like a little bit ago, so I'm kind of slurring my words, so leave me alone. Alright, so we are going to go, because I have fire and I have blast, group, that's group attack, that's single attack, and then I have heal, so I should go with some white magic, and I should go with revive. Yes, I should go with revive. I can add like sex symbols to it. Such a weird game. Alright, so now we gotta check magic, make sure it's all in alphabetical order. And now I can't remember what I do. Do I go to the inn? Let me reload my arm. Wait, wasn't there something in one of these barrels? Yep. I'm so awesome. <laughs> I can go to the local pub. Too bad you can't get hammered. But yeah, I'll have some uh, gin and tonic, please. Or no, Rudy, don't talk. I'll have some gin and tonic, please. Ugh. Ram people with my mouse. Alright, um. Let's see. Items, 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 items. Oh, hold on. I think there's an item over yonder. Over yonder! <clears throat> okay, there's only a heel berry. Uh, thank. Was there any other item? So, there might be one up in this one place over here. I either ran into a tree or a guy. Either way, it was not what I call a pleasant experience. Alright, um. Make sure Jack goes first. I like having a very definitive turn order. Helps out in a lot of battles. Like, alright, you, I mean, you can't plan for Jack to do something first and then Cecilia go, like... You dumb fucking dyke. Did I say you could do that? So... I'm guessing I gotta fucking, um... Go to the inn. 
It's been a long time since I've played. Leave me alone. Yep. <coughs> Alright. Tomorrow we'll go to the festival together. But I have to get going now. I have no idea why I was summoned to the North Room. But I'm glad to know I was of some help. You are a lot of help, bitch. Shall never forget our adventure. Wow. Really taking it to heart there. But now we go to sleep. Look at the bald guy. That bald guy's pretty cool. Kid's got like no fucking hair. The morning of the festival has arrived. It's fucking hallelujah time. I love the festival. And we got nice festival accompanying music. And now we have to sell some junk so we can make sure we have plenty of cash to spend at the festival. There's one or something in there, but maybe that's one I already got. I don't know. Sell a travel vest. Well, I ain't got much to sell. It's bogus. This is bogus, man. Alright, let's go to the festival grounds. Ow. Dyke. <coughs> Going to the festival. Look at it. Look at it in all its glory. Go up the stairs. That's where that festival's being held. Fuck yeah, look at this fucking old bastard. He's glad his son dragged him down here. What's this kid say? No kid. Did you see the golem? That was something. There should be a festival every day. Well, maybe in a perfect world there would be, you dumb faggoty ass kid, but guess what? And got fucking money to just fucking blow and have a festival every damn day. I mean, come on. Pull your head out of your ass, you dumb kid. <clears throat> no. We're trying to pilfer my shit. Prick. Alright, so here we have the golem Lolithia. The golem is known as the Ice Queen. In ancient legends, it froze the enemy demons to death. Excavation near Idlehide. Height 53 feet, 120 tons. That's a lot. Get on my face. <clears throat> Barbados, the weapon on its shoulders is a fire device. Hard armor reminds one of some indestructible fortress. Excavation, ocean of sand. Height 62 feet without weapon. Weight 210 tons. Motherfucker. <clears throat> Diablo, very powerful golem, flamethrower for close combat, tough but agile armor, good hand-to-hand -hand capabilities, nicknamed the Crimson Wind, Excavation Arctica, height 59 feet, 160 tons. Alright, very, very interesting. Alright, mysterious black box, no one cares. Hey, I'm gonna do my money, bitch. Cause you guys made it on time. Here's the payment. I demand a bonus. Alright. So there's three games and uh, well, four games, but only three of which give prizes. I'll check out the first one that doesn't give a prize unless it costs me money. Time trial run. No. <laughs> sure. <clears throat> Oh, shut up. Jack did that. Jack, McDollin, Peter, Scott, and Remy. Oh, I'm ashamed to have my name on a list with faggots like that on there. Alright, um. Next up, we'll check out the, uh. My least favorite game. I don't need to hear the rules. A <clears throat> hundred bucks just for this. You start running. You hit the button to stop, and you're trying to stop as close to the wall as possible, and he called me an idiot, and I don't like that game. 
Uh, now this one, you pick up the ball, only 30 bucks, and you're trying to get it to go near the bullseye, obviously. And it bounced far away, because that's bullshit. And I forgot to move my mouse around again, son of a bitch. No, I don't want to hear the rules, you fucker. Fucking faggot. Wow, what the hell is that? Yes. I'm pissed off now. Look at that. I got a bullet clip, but this is all small potatoes. Let's get to the good game real quick. The good game. <coughs> Which I will be playing if you love. Because I like this game. Lucky mole catching! I don't need to know the rules. Let's just play, bitch. Basically, the moles pop up, and you have to pick them up and throw them. Bring it on, motherfuckers. No! That's right, bag boys. That's right, you rat bastard. Oh, come on! Got a mystic apple. <clears throat> Play that again real quick. I don't need to know the rules. Don't give me this nonsense about needing rules. Alright. You little cunt. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, that's right, motherfucker. Yeah, bitch. Come on. No, 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 you fucking cunt, you dyke. And don't fucking piss me off. Alright, well, anyways, yeah, I got a couple of apples. I'm happy. <coughs> This is the Rune Festival. It's a good time. Usually I'll sit there and spend all my money at the mole catching place, but who the hell wants to see that? It gets boring after a while. So we go to town. Oh shit. Ow. I ran into a dyke. Damn dyke. I need a mint. Alright, so, let's see here, top right corner, we go up, and we're just per perusing the festival grounds, please help this woman, she's deeply distressed, my son is missing, he just disappeared into the crab, please can you help me look for him, he may be in trouble, I'm going to stay here so I don't miss him on this road. If you see him, bring him back to me. He has a red balloon, please. Well, listen, bitch. You better hope a lot of kids out there don't have fucking red balloons. That's a pretty vague description. And what's the kid wearing? What does he look like? Does he do a good Robert De Niro impression? I mean, come on now. Mom, mom, where'd you go? My balloon! Not my balloon! Yeah, bitch, your balloon. Uh-oh. What do we have going on here? We got some spooky, eerie fucking lightning. Suddenly dark clouds hovered over Adelheid. The laughter and the murmur cease. As the unsuspecting people look up to the sky as they watch the silent nightmare spread over their heads. Woo! The sky is cracking. That's like one of the weirdest things to ever happen, huh? The beginning of the end is here. 
His sword of light strikes the land, and a wall of fire rushes across the horizon. Oh, that's just weird. Quit cracking my sky. I liked it the way it was. Man, you believe these people? Oh shit, son. <coughs> Boom. <coughs> Check it out. Look at all that shit. Check it out, dead kid. You don't ever see that in games anymore. I don't think it's fun outside the town anymore. Let's play together here. I don't want to. Ow. <coughs> you see these motherfuckers trying to fuck with my princess? I don't think so. Like I say, what the fuck are you smoking? Haha, ha, I won that exchange. Ew. These lizard men suck. Ow! These lizard men hurt. And they're lively. So they're lively, defensive, and powerful. Shouldn't they be missing something at some point? I mean, come on. Why aren't they just the bee's knees? So shut up. About time they attack someone other than Jack. I mean, not that they have many options, but still. Someone else. Man, how about some critical? Do something. Wasting my time. And everyone else's. And he's apparently fast, because he's like going before Jack. This is bullshit. Your tea bag. I'll take those levels though. Kind of desperately need those. The gates of the castle will remain open for another five minutes. <clears throat> we must get everyone into the castle at once. All right, now we have to find all the survivors, and uh, for each survivor we find, we get a reward. I can't remember how many there are, but... So that's two. Three. I should let him eat you, dumb bitch. Four. Okay, <coughs> so that's four. Excuse me, lizard man. Uh, jack shit there. Nothing. Another dead guy. <coughs> Look at this guy trying to, or this bitch trying to hide. Five. Continuing. Six. Oh, this ain't no joke, son. You best be knowing what's going on. Up to six. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up. I'm not trying to leave, you dumb cunt. Is this guy up here alive? Oh, he had a boy. Is that seven? Okay, that guy's dead. Eight. Okay, now we just have the inner buildings to check. I think I'm at eight. Unless I'm miscounting. Alright, he's not okay. <clears throat> Shit fuck, man. Eight. Oh, there's a bitch. No. No. Nine.
Pretty sure it's nine. Better be fucking nine. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Ten. Uh. I want to say that's it. I've checked every building. I'm just saying that's it. And if I don't get all the rewards, then whatever. Superman! Going to the castle! Uh-oh, who do we have here? Also, Not even close to we humans. This is no contest. And he's laughing. Nothing for me to do here. Well, I guess my superior power is too good to use on humans. Oh, Bell Silk. Give this message to one of the humans running into the castle. If they don't give up the teardrop, we will tear the castle to pieces. Are the golems here? Are they working? All junk? Good. We don't want to fight those things. Why not? We have the golems now. This is a very interesting situation. Well, that's uncool. Because I'd worked for one of those golems. <laughs> and they continue their spree of awesome music. They like, well, let us depress you. Let a walk around as the princess. Like, I'm sorry. I know. Oh, it's really happening, dude. Okay, let's see if we can... This is a sealed by magic door. It requires an item called a duplicator. I would really like to have a duplicator, but alas, I do not, so. Here we have the kitchen, and over here we have a moonstone, which can just be equipped on her for now. Um, I can mystic it to cure poison, or I can equip it like that to just nullify poison, so. No poison. Can't be poisoning me, motherfucker. Alright, so here we have the, the chefs working fervorously. Wow, what a shitty castle. They don't have enough fucking food. They, they really try to depress you with this music. It's awesome. Love this music. I don't want to rest. Not a pussy. Oh, a treasure chest. A crest graph. That's a new magic spell right there. That's what I'm talking about. Whoa. They just like shoved them all right here. Two, four, six, eight, ten. That's all ten I saved. That's funny. All ten I saved go in the fucking corner. You the cow in the corner. All right, let's go upstairs. Through this door. I think it's a bunch of nonsense. There might be... 200 bucks, all right, all right. You know I'll accept that. Pretty sure it's all the treasure except what's in the fucking duplicator door that they just don't let you, let you enter at this point. Princess, the king has been injured. Please go to him, quickly. Like, what do you mean the king has been injured? Uh, Alright, well let's just go talk to the king, because there's no more items here, so... It's dangerous to be uh, out right now. Please stay in your room. Oh. Well, I don't want to get in my room. I wanted to go to the king's room. He must be on the uh, third floor. Pompous asshole. Why don't I get guards like that at my room? I want two guards. I don't feel important. I get one guard. He looks like a slacker. Fucking douchebag. Alright. 
What do you mean it doesn't look good? What the fuck are you getting at? Cecilia, I'm glad you're alright. Listen, Cecilia, the monsters are after you. You must defeat them. Can do? Your Majesty, the monsters demand that you surrender the teardrop or they will storm the castle. The teardrop belonged to my mother. It's very dear to me, but I'll give it up for the sake of my kingdom. The monsters can have my teardrop. That's right, it's her teardrop. Listen to this fucker. I won't permit it. <laughs> Coughs up along. Okay. It's not just an heirloom. It holds the key to unleashing the power of the ancients. Only a princess of the Adelheide family may possess it. One who hears the will of the guardians can use the teardrop to change the world. Oh, I can change the world. Can I, like, fix the sky that cracked? Because it looks disgusting. Life can be cruel sometimes. Stay in my room no matter what happens. I don't agree with what my father said. Innocent, innocent people should not suffer. In the dungeon, there is a secret passage. It should still be there. When I was a little girl, I remember trying to get to the town from there. So we're going to sneak out and defy my father's orders. Let me alone. Let me alone. Basically, if a guard touches you, you get sent back to your room. So... Yeah. It's a bunch of ball sack. BALL SACK! Okay. Uh... Sneak up through here. Oh shit, 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 shit! Leave me alone, leave me alone! Okay. Hey, douchebag. There is a curfew in place here at Etelhead. You still want to go, I understand. You will do what I say, you fucking cook. Like, seriously, that's how I get to enter? I fucking have to fall? Like, break my legs and shit? Alright, whatever. I'll save after I beat this area. Real gamers don't have to use every save point. <laughs> so we got a power apple. <clears throat> it's always pretty good. And this is apparently under the castle. Looks pretty snazzy razzy. We got a magic carrot. I'm sure there's a lot of guys out there that say they have magic carrots. So now we're fighting jelly blobs. And Jack can apparently one shot them, so no one cares about them. Cecilia is so physically weak, it's so sad. She can't even kill a balloon in one hit. It's so bad. So bad. You know, there might have actually been equipment in Adelheid I could have bought. Like, armor and weapon and stuff. But... Oh well. I can just buy it afterwards. It's no big deal. Or can I? I don't know, whatever. I'll just get the next equipment. I doubt it was gonna be that much of a fucking improvement anyway, so... Whatever. What the fuck ever. What's this gonna do, two? She did more to the jelly blob than the fucking balloon. What a dumb dyke. Holy shit. I hate her face. I wanna cut off her nose and shove it up her ass. Alright. <sighs> Cecilia level one up. I got a breeze cape. I'm pretty sure it's what she already has equipped. No, nope, we're all so proud of you for that one, you dumb bitch. You get a Mystic Apple. Power Apple goes to Rudy. And... Alright, we go down here first. I think... 
that all that's up down here is treasure, but who the fuck knows, right? I mean, you expect me to remember all this shit? It's been fucking many a year since I've played. Son of a bitch. I hate my computer. But I have a strawberry mint now, so it's all good. Man. Seriously, Icebreakers duos are so good. So good. Just kill him, Jack. There you go. I mean, it was Cecilia Boogie in that time. See that shit? She's getting down. We got an Agile Apple. That's pretty nice. Anything that gives permanent stat boosts, I'm a fan of. Such as that hardy apple. That's what I'm talking about. I love hardy apples. The Mora Toad. I'm gonna try a blast on them too. Shit. Damn! Damn, damn, damn! Ew, and they hit Rudy in the face with their tongue. Oh my god. Did you see Rudy get owned? That's uncool. He's restless. Well, bully for him. Celia is on her period, so take that. I mean, I don't know what he's doing bragging about being restless. Look at her get down. She's like, yeah, 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 yeah. Shaking that little royal ass. Pretty awesome. Alright, now. I just want to get out of here. No. That would have been... That would have been bad. I don't know if it would have actually let me use it, but it still would have been bad. I think this is the exit. Son of a bitch! Son of a fucking bitch! I knew that would happen. <clears throat> Alright. Take that jelly blob. You ugly green piece of shit. What was that stupid movie? Like, Flubber or some shit? What a retarded piece of film. God. Good counterattack, though, because now it just means Jack can kill him right here. Done and done. Holy shit, a critical he's pissed off. Wait, that was his critical? Didn't he do more with his regular attack? Or am I just seeing things? That was potentially retarded. <clears throat> we are going to go ahead and save here. We'll save on slot one. <clears throat> Alright, so now we're going to go up here. Boop, boop, boop. I want to do the next portion before I end the video, as it were. Alright. Um, I'll go like that. Now. Bring it on, motherfucker. Hand it over. You have to guarantee them. I'm a busy guy. Oh, he's a busy guy. Okay. There you go. That was good enough for me. 
Uh oh. What are you doing, Jack? Yeah, I don't know how you got here. But I'm gonna beat your balls in. <coughs> yeah, you can't do that. You're crazy. You're psychotic. I mean, do you not see a distinct size disadvantage here? You guys don't make very good toys. Well, fuck you. Alright, eat some hand cannon, eat some psycho crack, eat some flame, I guess. Let's see what we can do. This guy's big, green, and he's got teeth. And I don't want to. And he flipped out. He plant apparently needs to like go to the mental ward. All right, that's cool. That's better than him using his big, giant, enormous steel ball thing to break my people's faces because my people like their faces not broken. How about not missing this time? Thanks, faggot. Disrupting flare. Ow. Oh my god, you see that? Holy shit, Jack's hurting. Jack's crying now. Jack's like, motherfucker, why'd I go for revenge? I won't do it again. <coughs> Come and get me. Should you really be saying it like that, dude? With your weird creepy ass tail. I imagine that he said it like Elton John. <clears throat> Take this, psycho crap. Okay. Flame. He's got like a purple do rag on or something. I'm not sure if he's like trying. Oh shit! Ow! 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 Ouch! Not nice. I can mystic that breeze cape though. I forgot about that. Being able to mystic uh, Cecilia's equipment. So that's like one way of being able to use some spells and stuff that I don't have to use MP for and shit. So that's pretty cool. Might have to try that. See what I get. Take that, motherfucker. Well, this guy's pretty full of himself. Come and get me. We're gonna try a breeze cape. Try it on myself, whatever it is. <clears throat> I think it might be a uh, shield, actually. Pretty sure it's shield. I would accept shield at this mo at this point in time. Air screen. Oh yippee skippy. Air screen, really? What a bunch of balls. <clears throat> this dude needs to fucking die already. Some more fireballs right in his gut or something. I don't know. Looks like it's trying to knock him off his feet. This dude's like a demon gangster or some shit. He's like, nigga, please. Oh my god. Oh my god, help. Which means I have to make sure she's at full health at all times, because there's not much room for error with that attack, and I don't want her to die and miss out on the experience, because she's already missed out on some experience, and it pisses me off. Great, I'm out of fucking ammo. That's bogus, too. This whole thing's bogus. 
Yeah, take that, take that, take that. What was that? I feel like I'm being assaulted by a gnat. A gnat, really? Can't give me more credit than a gnat? You fucking green faggot. Son of a bitch. Come back when you're more of a challenge, kid. Don't call me kid. I'll bust you up. How you like it when I get all gangster on you? I'll bust you up. I don't know. <coughs> Bell Sulk is a slave driver. Why do we have to take this junk back? We gotta do what we're told. We got to get this done. Bye, Lilithia. Bye. Well, you know that's not gonna be good. You just know it. So now we have her. I disobeyed your wishes. I gave him the thing on her bobber and whatever. And now he's all butt hurt and he's like, nah, 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 nah. it's like whatever. Like, whatever, bitch. I have trusty friends. How you like that? She's got trusty friends. And they're looking at each other like bullshit, motherfucker. We were going to volunteer anyway, but you shouldn't come. Like what? Slow us down. She's our magician, you dumb asshole. If I'd have known who you were, I'd have thought twice about working with. What a cocksucker! I hate this kid. I want Bell Self to beat his ass now. How romantic. You can count me out. Kick him in the crotch. You don't apologize for your behavior. You're proud of what you did. She was lonely. Oh, She should try eHarmony.com. Her passion to save Phil Gaia is no lie. How can she convince him? Oh, that sounded healthy. Yes. It's far too heavy for a stupid little bitch like you. That's some sword. It looks more like a fucking steak knife, but okay. It's heavy with the weight of its destiny. He's really trying to make it sound really cool. Ah ha ha! Everyone's reaction or cutting her hair. That's funny. His sword is severed her past. We must reclaim peace. Like, well, she just cut off her hair. So if you're going to give her the whole no turning back speech, you might have wanted to do that before she cut off her hair. But, yeah, okay. So, <clears throat> King dies and five seconds later, Minister's like, oh, can't just sit around feeling sad. Like, okay, we just lost our king. You are aware of that, right? King died, you know, not even a minute ago. I mean, I hope somebody, like, goes up to the bald fuck, like, shotgun blasts him to the face. And in three seconds, oh, no reason to be sad. Can't just sit around feeling sad, you know. He only took fucking a 12-gauge shell to the fucking face. Alright, and now, the funeral. There's Cecilia, next, uh, next to the bald motherfucker right there, and uh, one of the many, many knights. And then, there we have some other bald guy, and what looks to be like a dyke, I don't know. And there's the, the sword tribute and the, the knight pallbearers, as it were. Everyone with their weapons drawn, their flags a waving in the wind. Mm, mm, mm. Cecilia should rock that black dress the rest of the game. That'd be pretty bitchin'. Look at all the other dead people in their wooden coffins. Like, you can't touch the good coffin. And you get some credits. 
Like, we beat the game! Woohoo! Take that! Thanks, Takashi Fukushima, or whatever the fuck your name is. What a great game! Could have been a little longer. Ooh, there's Emma. There's Emma. Oh, there's Ruby and Jack. But more importantly, where's Handpan? That's who we want to see. We have crying people. We don't know if they're crying for the king or some other dead person that... See, like, the dead person right there. Or right there. Or right there. Or right there. And you notice that all the dead people are being carried by the same exact people. Two blondes and a brunette. At least on that side. They could have probably mixed that up a little more, but... They're like, hey, who cares? Everyone's probably more focused on the little girl with the big red ball sitting next to Ruby. Will Ruby try and mack on her? Who knows? Some say that's in inappropriate. Some say she's too young. Rudy does not. Actually, I don't know what Rudy says. But now we're sitting there talking to the sisters and we're holding up the progress of all the other dead people. You there, stand there and hold the heavy coffin. I don't care if you have back problems. Carry it! Okay. See you, Wild Arms. Game over. Done. So yeah, that was probably even a shorter fucking playthrough than my Biohazard games. Oh, wait a minute! Oh, it's more game! One week from the date of the attack. We're gonna get our girl, save our game. This is our destiny. The three of us are going after the monsters. I really don't want to do this. We must, must fetch the princess. And I hear weird sounds from the living room. <laughs> okay. So anyways, we're going to go pick up the princess. We're going to fail at picking up the princess. She's in her room, isn't she? Yeah, she's sitting by her bed. Yeah, I'm gonna protect her. Let me just fucking find her first, you dumb cuntbag motherfucker. Hate this kid. I'm gonna rage quit. Alright, so here's our princess. She's looking, looking snazzy. Apparently her hair is a lot easier to manage. She can't sit and cry forever. She's waiting for the rainbow after the rain stops. She'll be strong again. Please take her with us. Uh, will do. Will do. Will fucking do. And there you go. Now we're going to save. We are going to fucking save. And if you don't like it, then you can kiss somebody's rump. I don't know. So, saving, 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 saving. Seven, seven, six. See, that, all, that one battle made all the difference. Look at that. Seven, seven, six. It's supposed to be seven, seven, seven. Oh well. See you next video.